Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Konichi. What? My name is Tudor Vinny and I will be your host for today. So, what topic will we be talking about in this episode? Hmm. So that's right everyone. Today we'll be talking about dogs. Hello. And cats in Japan. So sorry I woke you up. So what are we waiting for? Let's jump right into it. For starters, I myself have a lot of dogs. They bring me so much joy and happiness. And it seems like Japan agrees with me because dogs are the most popular types of pets there. There are many dog breeds, but one of the most iconic one is the Shiba Inu. So remember Doge, Doji, Doggy? I don't know how to pronounce it. But it's that one cute and derpy internet meme. So she is actually a Shiba Inu named Kabu-chan. Aside from the Shiba Inu, there are other popular dog breeds in Japan that include Japanese Spits, Chihuahuas, Poodles, and the Akita. Aside from dogs, Japan is also obsessed with cats of all types. You can find their influence prominently in their culture. There are a lot of cat-inspired designs and animations, and there are famous cat figures like Hello Kitty and Doraemon. One thing that I know that pet owners love to do is to dress up their pets. So in Japan, there are many unique items. An example would be a cute cat hat in Gachapon Machine. They mostly come in fruit, flower, and candy designs. Another example is the beautiful and intricately designed pet kimonos. So they are very iconic in Japan. In addition to that, dog owners can showcase their well-dressed and well-groomed pets in the Wanwan Carnival in Yoyogi Park every April. The carnival has free dog snacks and various dog activities, as well as charity events for dog shelters. And also, be on the lookout for professional dog photographers and get those lovely photos with your loving pets. Meanwhile, cat lovers and owners have the Yushima Cat Festival. There are all sorts of cat-themed items and food for humans and cats alike. However, unlike the 1-1 carnival, the Yushima Cat Festival spans an entire month, usually starting around February to include Japan's official cat day, which is on February 22. Well, that's all the time we have for today. I hope you guys enjoyed talking about dogs and cats in Japan. There are still a lot of different topics and facts to be uncovered in Japan. So always tune in in our Rare Job channel. Again, I am your host, Tudor Vinny, and this has been Konichi. What? <laughs> Brought to you by Rare Job, giving chances to everyone and everywhere. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel and click the bell to get notified for our latest updates. Until then, I'll see you next time. Bye guys!